What's up guys? Welcome to another video with Zaman Tew. If you're watching my channel for the first time, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. These are my two friends. Hi, I'm Fareba. Hi, I'm Chandra. So today we'll be doing a robotic show that is held in our building by robot.com. So today, so I'm going to read a brief and briefest and explain we'll be doing the project and combine the pieces. Right, yeah, so I am up to summit with this company called Junkbot, which is a do-it-yourself robotic kits, uh, where kids can build robots just by recycling things around them. They could then program it uh, to do different tasks. Today, uh, with the team of young minds, uh, we have uh, three different robots built here. One that can recognize your face and then read it read your emotions basically it can tell you if it's sad happy or something like that and here we have another one which is um, a voice recognition system which can recognize your voice and then you can communicate with junkbot is a diy robotic kit that enables us to create and build working robots from almost anything it transforms household objects such as plastic bottles and old cds wooden spoons or cardboard into unique imaginative robots that can be programmed for a variety of functions and at different levels of skill as they delight in making new shapes come alive we learn the core stem concept of analytical thinking problem solve solving prototyping lateral thinking and building We had a robotic show here. Uh, we are not going to build a robot here, but it's more of you know for you to see, experience small little humanoid robots. Have you done robotics earlier? Anyone? No. no. Yeah, there's someone there. No. Yeah, he did. Uh, I think those elders they did that. Uh, now, what is your experience in doing robotics? I have I have it's built a robot dog. Huh? It's all based on programs. Mm. Okay. I have done robotics. I just started when we were in grade 9. My friend and myself. Uh, so we used to break toys actually. And then convert it into a, something different. Take part in all the science phase that's there. Uh, you know, run through competitions and, and it was there. And then when we came here in Dubai, we said, you know, why not we give the power to, to the kids by itself to develop things. And to our surprise, we didn't see much of the, uh, you know, robotic companies here, except for Legos and little bits and things like that. But we thought we have to do something more. Uh, you know, the problem with the existing kits is you don't get to understand what is inside the kit. That's why we created a kit which where you can see everything from little wires to each component. Let's say we have different sensors. Now this is an IR sensor, there's Sorry, motors. I can't help with that yet. There's a lot of them. So the idea of junk bot is to start very low, even, you know, just to see how a lighting system works. And from there, you can even build a solar system. Sorry, a smart city, not a solar system. But this board is so powerful that you can create a, soul, uh, a, a smart city by itself. Now you progress, how you start, you start just by learning software programs and, and here is a, here is a program that we run. Have you, have you heard of Scratch, Scratch program? On, on, on understanding how uh, a software works and then how you upload this software to the hardware. And then accordingly, once you program it, the robot works. For example, we have three different robots here today. Yeah, so today we have three robots here. One, you know, which understands your voice. That's this one. One that understands your face, which is a visual recognition. One that works with the with the remote. So, so the idea is to see what is it. I would say, you know, this is the motherboard. 
every every robot inside has this. Now you can connect different sensors. For example, the motor is connected to this, and it's running. If you if you can just look into it, it's running. So. Uh, Likewise, this is a buzzer. You can program it to say, you know, make some sounds, uh, make some music and things like that. And, and it would work accordingly. Now for you kids, it is more about to learn how, you know, you connect the motors, how you turn it probably front, back, left, right. And then you can connect it with your robot and you can build anything you Something like Alexa. Now, again, this can be programmed in a much different way. You can ask it, you know, say, uh, cook me a pizza. So then if your setup is connected, then it will actually cook the pizza for you. Or, you know, you can say that. Did you see the Alexa? Alexa, prepare me a, a, a coffee. Uh, open the door for me. You know, you can connect, you can do anything. You can say, you know, uh, robot, switch on the light then you can go and, and the light would be on. So you can program it that way. And you know, it, really do it. it can really do it. This is small, but we can do it in a much bigger you know, way. Again, we don't do industrial. It's not industrial. It's just to teach you that, you know, this is the way how you program it. Right, so you can connect a small bump, not a bigger one, and then program it to say that, you know, whenever I say switch on, the light will be on. So whenever you come home and say, you know, switch on, then the light will be on. Switch on. <laughs> so yeah, you can just come. Uh, you have already saw that, but I'm not sure. There's one more guy there. Yeah, I think most of them saw this, but most of them missed on this. So this is this is a vision recognition. It has a small camera. If you see very tiny camera and then there's a sound system that's there now it recognizes the face and then say you know if you're sad it's blue but then you smile and then then the light turns up so it could recognize saying that i'm happy or i'm sad that's how it is programmed right now When you press A, then it turns. Right. Now, when you press A, then turn. This is what left. But then you can say, and then say. Okay. Now, if you turn this to 90, 45, whatever it is. Okay. Now you press click. Click. So it keeps on moving. Okay. Why? Because you said when you click this, forever, which means forever, turn. Forever turn 68 degrees. So it will keep turning. Won't stop. Now, if you want to do only this. Now, if you say one click, it, it turns only once. This is stop. This is stop. No. No. Yes. 
Go to junkpot.co, www.junkpot.co, and then you know you can buy the product from there. You can learn different uh, you know courses from there. Thank you. For watching this channel, if you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe.